Hi guys, uh, basically this is just a quick guide for Vito and on how to do uh, add mores and embeds and things like that. So yeah, first off, good job on this, you've done quite a good job here, yeah? Okay, you've got your image up and everything like that and that's fine, yeah? Now from there we're going to the text editor. Okay, now because of embeds like uh, on pan uh, on the streams and things like that on Twitch, they automatically start. And if it's on the main page, it becomes a problem because the you'll have like five videos playing all together at the same time. Yeah, uh, automatically, and it'll jump straight to that video, and it's a pain ass for everybody concerned. Yeah. So what you have to do is put it behind a more. So when you go into event hubs and stuff like that, that's why they don't put the stream on the main page. Yeah, it's always behind it, add more. So all you do is you click on the more. And anything after that, they have to click on to view more. So that's fairly straightforward, right? Now getting the embed code, yeah? Uh, so let's go to Twitch. And should have Pandax no Twitch. dot TV slash Pandax Gaming Two. Okay, now, this will take me to. You, so I will have to quickly pause the stream. So yep, there we go. Okay, so we're at your stream. Yeah, all you do here is click on share. And it gives you the two embed codes that you need. Right, you just take this, put it in here, yeah. And uh, the thing I do want you to take out is the watch live video on Pandax text pish, yeah. Uh, let's see, which is all of this, yeah. It's just a uh, uh, everything that's after the A. You know, the bracket A and then at the end it's bracket close with A, yeah. All that does is put a little link underneath the stream, it'll take you to direct to the thing. It's not really necessary, if you want to do it, you just double click on the window anyway. And it'll do that anyway, yeah. And it kind of adds a problem to the, the stream in general, yeah. Uh, the, the actual chat that I'm going to put here at the bottom. Okay, so here's the chat here. Okay, now we'll go cross back to the visual editor. Okay, and after the more, which you'll see, here's the stream. Yeah, so all we do is resize it slightly smaller. Well, that one anyway. Now, this one is the chat. Now the problem you see is I can't resize it diagonally without it taking it diagonally here. Yeah, you know what I mean. So all I want to do is resize it small. Yeah. You take the size of this, which should come up here. Uh, and the big number is obvious, obviously the width. Yeah. So what I want is around 569. Okay. So... All I'll do is cross back to here. Here's the little embed code for that. See where it says width 569. Right. It is 200. It's going to 569. Okay. So when I go back to the visual editor, they're the same size and they fit roughly on a, on a screen. Yeah. That's, that's fairly basic, straightforward stuff. So you've got your embed in your chat. So I'm just going to update this with a publish. Right, and I'm going to show you what it looks like on the actual thing, and then I'm going to stop and upload this video for you. Okay, let's just go to view post. Yeah, there we go. Look, and you go further down. Here's your stream. I'll pause it, and here's the chat. So people would be able to watch the stream and have a little chat at the same time on the site. It's as simple as that. Uh, okay, end this. Do, 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 do.